Guys, I get married in three months. And here comes the bride, all dressed in white. You guys, my wedding is gonna be off the chain. Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you're here, it's because you are either getting married, you know someone that's getting married, or you're just trying to be all up in my business. Whatever the reason is, I am so happy that you're here watching my video today. If you're new here, make sure you click the like and subscribe button at the bottom. My name is Ari and you guys, I get married in three months. Is it three months? I have so much stuff to show you. In my previous videos, you can see where we went venue shopping. We've picked our venue, everything is set. You guys have seen like quite a lot. I was just thinking like, I should show you guys what I have so far. The venue that we chose, it is an all-inclusive venue. It comes with everything except a cake, flowers, and my dress of course like outfits it comes with literally everything it is well within our budget and we couldn't have been more happier with the venue that we chose i am not going to be showing any of the outfits i have for like my bachelorette party or anything like that because that's going to be in its own separate video so i am diying a lot of my stuff everything else is included including the food it's open bar it's all of that so if you're in arizona and you need the hookup on a venue that's affordable message me send me a message on instagram send me a message on tiktok a lot of the wedding videos that I have been watching have been wedding videos of people that have already had their wedding my issue with this is that actually it's I don't know what it is but it's an issue a lot of people don't like sharing what they're going to do for their wedding or what they're going to have for their wedding because they don't want anyone to copy them you're not the first person to get married so more than likely the idea that you have in your head or the items that you have for your wedding have already been used by someone else I have no issue showing you guys what I have for my wedding so far if you like any of my ideas then do it if you want to know where something is from then ask and i'll tell you that stuff doesn't bother me like it bothers other people i don't know but when it comes to like baby names and this and that mm -mm. if you're not getting my baby name this wedding stuff take it take it and use it and be successful because we are brides on a budget baby brides on a budget we've invited 126 people we've already sent out save the date we've already sent out our invitations our invitations were sent out like three weeks ago and we've already had over half of those people rsvp the best thing to do for bridal advice and for wedding advice is to join groups on facebook a lot of my ideas have either come from there or from tiktok wedding items has its own space its own spot and i cannot wait until this stuff gets out of this fourth room you guys i don't know if they still have it but let me tell you what i picked out from the target bullseye section if you have me on tiktok then you probably have already seen some of this stuff i have hats socks for the groom fox say bride as well these socks were a dollar bride the groom they say the best day ever one is for the bride one is for the groom and the bride's kit comes safety pins hair ties needle and thread a nail file and some scissors bobby pin and the groom's emergency kit comes safety pins a comb needle and thread a nail file all that good stuff Next on my shelf, I have a pack of hangers. I got a 10 pack of hangers from Tuesday morning. Brides usually gift their bridesmaids hangers to hang up their dresses. I'm gonna have my maid of honor print out cricketed. Is that what the word is? I'm gonna have each of their names put on this hanger by that cricket machine. That's my motto. If there's a sale, go in the store. Don't use that motto. You're gonna have $3. Look what I found. Uh, this is a cake stand. If you're gonna do your own little personalized cake, Target has these cute little stands. These are only $5 each. I also forgot to add that we are also responsible for our own photographer, which we have. So when I show you this next item, I don't want you to guys think like I don't have a photographer because I do have a photographer. He's a great photographer. I have a photographer. I was not going to have a wedding without doing this. And you guys, these were not easy to find at all. So of course I have like more than this. Two come in a pack. We paid a lot of money for them. But this was a must have for my wedding. I think there was like a sale happening when we did buy it. Buy them when they go on sale. Because one camera costs like $20. And I don't know who's spending that money, but it wasn't us. We ordered this cake topper from Etsy. I might can slide it out to show you. Let me check. This is the cutest little cake topper I have ever seen. It says the Trowers because that's gonna be my new last name, the Trowers, the Trowers. Let me put this back. That was our cake topper for our cake that we have not ordered yet and we have less than three months to go. Don't even know where we're gonna get the cake from. Anyways, this says 
for your happy tears. Let me show y'all what's up in this box. I have tissue, you guys. Little packets, and they say, for your happy tears, you better be crying. Okay, so this next item that I am gonna show you guys, I still haven't DIY'd. This is going to be like a DIY project that I have not started yet. I've only done one and I don't like it, so I'm gonna do it over. I'm making my own signs for my wedding. I'm not gonna pay anyone to make signs I'm never gonna use again. So you see like this clear thing? So this is what I ordered from Amazon. This is like a rough draft of what my signs are gonna look like. I'm gonna make one for the bar when you walk in, blah, blah, blah. I printed this on my own paper. Let's slip this out. Your printed paper from Amazon. Make your own sign. Don't pay someone to do that. From Victoria's Secret, I ordered like these little makeup bags. I plan to gift to my bridesmaids, my mother of the bride, mother of the groom. I plan to gift these to my bridal party at the end. And these were literally three dollars. Buy your stuff when it goes on sale. Then it feels like you're not spending a lot of money. The flowers do not come with my venues. I'm DIYing all of the floral arrangements myself. These are the petals that I got from Etsy. I don't know how to make them any. White roses and baby breaths. That's all I want. I don't really care for floral arrangements. Here comes the bride, all dressed in white. This is what it's looking like, you guys. Photo booth props. Our photo booth props came from Etsy. That was also another thing that I loved about this venue is that it came with its own photo booth. Okay, so this is what I have to show you guys now. What? I saw this thing on TikTok and I was like, wait a minute, wait a minute. I need a money gun at my wedding, y'all. I want it to rain down on me. The last thing that I'm gonna show you guys today in this little wedding haul video is my most absolute favorite item of the wedding. You can't go wrong with this, okay? We have our own glow sticks. We have our own glow sticks for the wedding, for the reception. It says Mr. and Mrs. Trower, because that's gonna be my last name. I'm not gonna turn it on. I don't even think I can turn it on yet because I didn't put a battery in here. We got these from Etsy. I don't know the battery size. The most I did was take it out the box to show you guys. You guys, my wedding is gonna be off the chain. I'm so excited for this wedding. I have so much more to share with you guys. I still have a bachelorette trip to go on. I still have a bridal shower to attend. So if you guys are wanting to see more, if you have any questions, please just leave them in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching my video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe to my channel.